All right, I'm here in Virginia Beach at Landstown Commons, right by Fetty McCool's. And um, just wanted to show you that real quick. I had four customers tonight. One of them um, at Damneck, I had to cancel on because I was waiting for her like 10 minutes and I did try to con I did contact her actually and she said she's right there by the gate, but it took her forever. So I told her, I was like, hey, you know, politely, this is the business. And, you know, so I had to cancel on her, unfortunately. But uh, I still got paid for that because I had to wait. Uh, after I got to the area, I had to wait more than five minutes. So you get, if you wait more than five minutes for someone, you can get paid um, if you, you know, cancel them. So remember that with uh, Uber and also with Lyft. Of course, with Lyft, they require you to try to, um, to call them. Um, Uber doesn't. But I usually try to call them anyway as a courtesy. You know, I'm not trying to not pick anybody up. But at the same time, when I am doing this, you know, I want it to be as efficient as possible. So, um, as you saw from basically doing, I had four customers, but actually having three completed trips and still getting paid for the one that I had to cancel on. Um, I basically made $20, basically. Um, which, for this little car I have, will fill the gas tank up. So in one, I think it's an, I think it's an hour 35 on my app, actual time online. Um, so I was actually out close to two hours because I turned my phone, my app off a couple of times on my phone. Um, had to update it from the Google Play Store. But basically in less than two hours, I made 20 bucks just kind of doing this leisurely uh, driving Uber. I do do Lyft too, but the thing about Lyft is in Hampton Roads, be aware Instead of me getting pings in Virginia Beach, Lyft this time of night likes to send you out to Chesapeake or deep, deep out Pungo part of the beach where Uber tends to be pinging more uh, with, cl with clients that are closer to you so you're not burning as much gas going out there. I do them both, but I do Uber most of the time. And if you're going to do Uber, a few things I wanna recommend to you. Um, if you have a, if you're, have a smaller car like, the, like my Cube, or maybe a Nissan Versa or um, a Honda Fit. Those are the best cars to do Uber X in. Um, to do Uber X or uh, uh, or in this area, XL, because we only have Uber X and XL here in Hampton Roads. Your vehicle needs to be able to carry at least four people. It has to be 2005 or newer. Um, if you can get a 2007 vehicle, that'll give you a couple of years. You know, you can be on the platform because as time goes on. Uh, different model years will drop off because your cars are getting older. Mine's an 09, so I have like about four years I can do this before I have to get something else if I want to continue to do Uber and Lyft. They're pretty much about they're pretty much about the same. Um, but I just want to show you that um, it's a Wednesday night, not one of the busiest nights um, at all. And I wanted to show you what you can do in less than two hours if you come out here. You're smart about where you put your car at. You don't drive your car around so much. Um, and you can make you know a decent amount of side money for Hampton Roads I wouldn't necessarily me personally recommend doing this full-time Unless of course you have no choice like what happened to me when the cataract thing befell me And I had to do it for a little while full-time until I could return to driving buses, but for us for a part-time job um, You know I work what I want um, doing uber and lyft and um, if, if I can't sleep tonight and it's two in the morning and I want to get up and make a couple dollars. I can get up in Hampton Roads at two in the morning, turn on Uber or Lyft and I will go out and I will make a couple of bucks. Or I can stay at home in bed, toss and turn, not fall asleep for two hours. Or I can go make myself tired by working some and then come back home and pass out knowing I made money and knowing therefore I've gotten myself closer to the dreams that I have for myself uh, to be basically debt free uh, and to get a couple of things done in my life that I want to get done for myself and also for my family and friends so while Uber and Lyft will not make you rich um, it is a side job and it gives you an opportunity to be your own boss so once again I'm going to post this I'm going to give you my um, referral code for Uber and for Lyft uh, for both of them right now of course it always changes right now in Hampton Roads Sign up for Uber or Lyft. Do the required trips within 30 days using my referral code. You make 100 bucks after you do that. And of course, I make 100 bucks for referring you. As far as Lyft is concerned, use my referral code. And I think the per current promotion is 
like you get like your first like 50 bucks worth of like like trips your first trip whatever once you first sign up for lyft as a as a rider so even if you don't want to drive you can as a rider you know get a benefit from that now of course some of you are going to see this in different markets um relative of mine she lives in the dc market um driving for uber she did her required 50 uber trips in 30 days she got three hundred dollars i've shared it with you before and i got three hundred dollars i've heard san francisco uh and some other places could be 750 up to a thousand dollars for uber and lyft because uber and lyft are in a uh a competition a war if you will <laughs> i'm in the middle of both of it of both of them and um they're trying to get drivers out so that people will use their services and use their uh platform so there's still plenty of money to be made. Uh, Hampton Roads is not the busiest area for Uber uh, and for Lyft, but like DC, Chicago, especially San Francisco, where Uber and Lyft are both based out of, um, you know, LA. Uh, if you want to make some good side money and, you know, be your own boss, either full time or part time, like I do it part time, then Uber and Lyft uh, doing them both. Uh, it's a good opportunity for you. I'm going to link both of my um, referral codes to this video. I'm probably going to post it on YouTube, but uh, and obviously I'm going to post it on Facebook as well. So if you have any questions, you can hit me up on Facebook Messenger, or if you're on YouTube, you can hit me up whatever via by, uh, Google services and uh, ask me some questions, and I'll do my best to answer those questions for you. Um, and that's about it. So live from Virginia Beach. Uh, making some money while you're watching TV. I'm out.